Hi guys, welcome back to tutorials. Today we are going to do nature bags. Nature bags. We have sequins on our hands from the last we, arts and crafts. We have to we have to do this on the nature bags. And this is called a stencil. Yeah. <laughs> Here's your bag. I'm a nut. So there's the bag that we're going to use. But what in the world is this? Don't huh? fold it. We have aluminum foil. Don't fold it though, okay? Be careful holding it. No, leave it like that until you read the instructions. Okay. And then we have, what are these? Stickers? What are those? No, they're pictures. Oh, you know what they are? What? When we go outside to the park, don't bend it. When we go outside to the park, we're going to look and see if we can find these items. So I get to ask us to try and find oh, some mommy. ants, some ladybugs, and flowers, and rainbows. Ooh, Ooh. rainbows. Oh, rainbows are the best. Maybe it's a scavenger hunt. So that's got strawberries, and bumblebees, and bugs, and trees. I am not looking for bumblebees. This is the wrong season, but it's got snowmen and footprints and icicles and snowflakes. And we're not in that season anymore, are we, Lily? Nope. Wait. And then this one. Toys, toys, toys. Toys, toys, toys. This one's got the Halloween type stuff. So maybe throughout the year we'll be able to do it. Okay, so I'm going to read the instructions. What is this? I can't see. It's a mushroom. We have mushroom, worm, flea, a flea, and a nut, and a spider, and spider web, and a leaf, and another leaf, and a tree that's cut off, and a squirrel. Okay, so the instructions say, as you go out on your nature walk over the year, observe and discuss the change in, changes in the woods through each season. Observe the different habitats of animals and notice how plants and animals depend on each other for survival. So this is going to be a really fun challenge. We can call these challenges. You like Because you like challenges, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let me go get a cup. It says we need a cup of water. That's the only thing that we don't have. Okay, I'll put it in there. Okay, here you go. There's a handle, so read, carry, so carry it carefully. Don't spill it, don't spill it. Okay, okay. All right. So, before we get the bag, I'm going to hold the scissors for just a minute. It says, step one is lay the foil sheet on a stain-resistant surface. Fill the cup with water. So we have the cup filled with water, and we're on our arts and crafts table because this table has got Play-Doh stuck to it, and paint stuck to it, and all the kinds of stuff stuck to it. You want the sticker? Came back. Boop. Oh, your hair. I'm not a boy. It's not a say you're a boy, silly. Y'all that I am a boy. Yeah, we'll put this in your... Um, Pretend that you're very mean and you draw a boy on there. And uh, you said, there, you are a boy. We will put that in your emotion book when we get done. Your but thought journal. It's a girl emotion book, not a boy emotion book. So this says that the tissue paper is going to stain our fingers and our skin and your shirt. So be careful with it, okay? I don't want to stain my shirt. No, me neither, so we're going to be super careful. Okay, help me lay it flat. Smooth it out. Okay. All right. So now this one, step two, says cut the tissue paper into rectangles. Bigger shapes tend to work best. Lay tissue flat all over the foil sheet. 
and use the paintbrush to dab water onto the tissue paper until it's wet. So I'm going to let you place the tissue paper how you want to. Don't use only pink. It's got all kinds of colors. There's pinks and orange and I'm going to use pink. And green. We're going to use more than just one color, though. Okay. Okay. I'm going to use all the colors. It said that big rectangles work best. So we're going to cut, 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 cut. Mom? Okay, there's your first rectangle. Separate them. Okay, there's blue. Okay, you can use the ones Mommy separate if you can't do it. I want to do it. Okay, they are all over the foil. Yep. Um, here's pink. a pink. Here's I love pink sandwich, you. You did. Green. So the colors are blue, orange, pink, red, and green, it looks like. Not yet. We have to get all the, t the tissue paper on the, on the foil first, okay? Okay. Make sure you can't see any foil. I see foil. We'll keep coloring, uh, covering it. There's blue. Oh, you're not getting the instructions all over the place. <laughs> that was on purpose. I watched you do it. Okay, look, there's green and pink. You're silly. Here, put some more pink on there. You have a lot of other colors and not a lot of pink. What's going on, crazy? I had a lot of dream of pink, pink. You gonna put some green on there too? No, I don't like green. But green is part of grass, which is outside, and this bag is for when we go outside. Okay. So you wanna put some green on there? Yeah. There you go. I like all of the colors. Yeah, mommy does too. I like the whole house, but it doesn't have this, a whole bunch of the colors that I like. I like white. Mm. White with blue on it. White with blue on it. Okay, let's get it all covered. Let's get it all covered. We're getting there. Mm. Get the stops to snack in the process, though. It's okay. You don't want me to help you? You know that I got it all separated? You gotta make sure it's completely covered, it says. No open spaces. There's no open space. Our neighbor sent us a message, so we're gonna have to read it in just a minute. Okay. So we can have our play date. We're almost done. Okay. Now I can't see the instructions. <laughs> you did okay. it. Go like this and dab it. Just dab, just dab it like that until it's all wet. Wow, look at how the water is spread inside. Let's send it to our friends. Be careful. I see something there. Hey, don't do that. You're supposed to just go like this. Baby, that's just the tissue paper. You're ripping the tissue paper. Okay, come over here where it's wet and where it's dry. And get the rest of the tissue paper. This one's dry. So I need to wet it. Okay. We well, just don't paint it yet. We're going to go all the way across like the instruction says. And then we're going to take it off? We'll see. The instructions say, put your bag... You know, place your two can box in the bag to prevent the colors from seeping through. You lay the bag on top of the tissue paper and press down. Gently peel the bag off. Let's just get it all the way colored. And you got all this over here that's still wet too. Do 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 do. Oh. No picking up the phone. Well, I had to get it set up so that they could see what you were doing. But now it doesn't want to stay. 
careful. It's starting to, colors are starting to go all over the place. Yeah. Starting to change colors to you? Yeah. <laughs> I'm okay, turning into the enough. Hulk. Oh, get that blue one. Yeah. Careful. Okay. You ready? Place it down. Push it down. Push all over. Mom, it's stained the toothbrush. The paintbrush? It, it's stained the paintbrush. It stained, Mom, it stained the paintbrush. It did. Show the camera. It's, it's over here. It stained the paintbrush. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So it says gently peel the bag off. So very softly peel it off. Uh-oh. Keep going. Slowly, slowly, slowly. <gasps> Whoa! Okay, yeah. let's peel that. Very careful. Very careful. You want me to do it? Okay. Guys, are you ready to see this? Are you ready to see Lily's artwork? Hang on. Okay, show them, show them. Wow! That is so cool. Mom, now, let me show you on the back. What does it say on the back? Oh, uh-oh. Nothing. It says a bunch of things. What well, says something on there. Okay, let me see. So, it's right. Take the bag with you when you go on a nature walk and collect no, objects. You you have to do that. Right. It and says and that, and that it time. says when you get there. Okay, so the step that we're on is on step number four. And step number four says when the bag is ready, uh, when the bag is dry, so we have to let it dry for a few minutes. Use stencils and markers to add some decorations. So it came with this really cute little bag of markers. And we're gonna use these in a minute. To color on our nature bag. Yep. Okay, that's it for now. We're gonna have to go blow dry it. Say bye, guys. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Welcome back to tutorials. Today we are going to color our bag. We're gonna oh, use yep. the stencil that they gave us, and we're gonna color in on our bag. Nope, mommy bought it. The, the mailman brought it to us. The, ma the mailman bought it to us. Mm hmm. And that can happen. Ah. So, what all colors came with your with your stencils? What color markers do you have? So, I have red, three, <laughs> and blue, four, and green. Five and orange six. 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 So what happened to one, two? One and two. Mm -hmm. We got four markers in the pack, and then it has red, green, orange, and blue. And now she's going to use her stencils. This is called, look at this. See what I'm pointing to? Mm -hmm. Look, that's called an acorn. Those are usually brown, but you can make it whatever color you want to. What is this? Leaf. What is that? It's a paw print. No, it's a dog print. Yeah, a dog footprint. Dog footprint. Okay, and then that is a... Flower. Flower, so let's get the color in. We probably shouldn't do snacks while we're recording, should we, Lily? Got an upside down bag of Funyuns. Oh. 